Hello folks, welcome to Sherwood Park Toyota located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Today I'm going to be showing you this 2018 Toyota Sienna SC Technology. Now the most notable features on this SC Technology is its DVD player. You also have your navigation system along with your blind spot monitoring. Now I'm going to go through a couple more features on the inside and outside of the vehicle just to get you better familiar with this 2018 Toyota Sienna SC Technology. Let's get started. Now a couple of the exterior features that you will see on this SC technology is its daytime running lights. You also have your fog lamps and then if you take a closer look just over on the side, you have your 19 inch aluminum alloy wheels. You also have your foldable mirrors as well as your heated mirrors and then taking a look on the inside of the mirror, you're going to see your blind spot monitoring indicator. Now with that indicator it will actually light up just looking at there is another vehicle right beside you. And then taking a look at the second row here, you do have your second row captain seats. And then if you take a look at the third row and the second row, as you can see, you have the sunshade visors just located in the back there. You also have the DVD player. And then if we take a look just on the inside here, you're going to see the open and close button there. Now the nice thing is it does have the jam protection feature. So in the event that it does sense there's an obstruction in the way, it'll open itself back up automatically. And then if you want to close it from the outside, just pull on the handle once more and it will close for you automatically. Now the color we're going to be taking a look at today is red and taking a closer look at the front dash as well as the front seats. You have your black leather interior seat surfaces with your power driver's seat with lumbar support. Over on the left hand side you have your traction control on and off and then on the inside of the driver's side door you have your mirror controls, window locks, power locks and window controls. Now, taking a look at some of the controls on the steering wheel, you have your volume control, seek function, mode select, voice recognition, Bluetooth, scroll function for your multi-informational display, with your lane departure alert and cruise control. Now, taking a look at the multi-informational display, you'll see a couple of different features on there. So, taking a look, you have your digital speedometer on here, along with your distance to empty, fuel economy, and then you can also go through your compass, audio, lane departure alert, messages, and your settings menu with your ECT power, blind spot monitoring, rear cross traffic alert, lane departure alert, and a couple of other additional features. Now, if we take a closer look just at the center dash as well as the touch panel display, you'll see a couple of different features on here, which include your, if you go inside the menu screen, destination audio phone, as well as a couple of other additional features. Now taking a look just on the inside here it has the Entune app suite on it so with the Entune app suite you can use such apps as the slacker app which allows you to stream your uh, sorry your uh, music from your phone onto the touch panel display you can also check on local fuel prices or on the latest sports scores just depending on what your preferences are you have the Sirius XM satellite radio on here dual zone climate control settings with your rear temperature controls located down below hazard lights uh, matted to an automatic transmission with your heated seat controls for your driver and passenger USB up at the very top here you have your auto dimming rear view mirror with integrated garage door opener and digital compass and then you'll find the open and close for the power sliding rear doors, power lift gate, SOS safety connect, sunglass case holder and then taking a look at the backup camera as you can see you have those nice guiding lines in there making things much easier for you when you back into a stall. Finally we'll be taking a look at your rear cargo area as well as your tailgate now located on the back of your tailgate you'll see your backup camera just on your left hand side and your rear hatch release located underneath your Sienna emblem. Now, closing in on the rear cargo space, as you can see, you do have the middle seat actually stored in the back here from your second row. So if you're not using it, you can just place it in the back. But if you are using it, it does act as an additional cargo space. And as you can see, depending on what your needs are for, you can have one of the seats down or both of them down. And then in the event that you need a combination of both, you have plenty of cargo space and still passenger capacity. You have the power outlets just located on the right hand side and then when you're all finished up all you have to do is push on the back of the tailgate once and it'll close for you automatically making things a lot easier for you especially when you have your hands full of grocery bags or the kids sports bags. Thank you so much folks for watching this video today. If you have any questions please visit us. We're located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Phone number is 780-410-2455 or please visit our website at sptoyota.com to get us by email. Once again, folks, thank you so much for watching this video today. If you have any comments or any additional questions, please leave them in the comments section located down below. Other than that, make sure you have a great day and I hope to see you next time.